some deign to call me a villain. And I ask, what's wrong with opening the door for a lady? And the fact that I set the entire building on fire afterwards is not remotely relevant. My name is Total Biscuit. Oh, yes, and this is Dark Halibut. A terrible pronunciation. Never ever say that. Especially not in front of him. Well. So, I'm on top of this lighthouse. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> I like climbing on things for the sake of climbing on things. And I think that's really great. And you want to know why I think that's really great? Because it brings back that little element of exploration that is now missing for the vast majority of us in other MMO games because they've been data mined to death. I've been insulating myself deliberately from all manner of things regarding this game. Playing it simply on my own terms, at my own pace. And of course recording all of it, so... To me, there's still a lot to explore, there's a lot of mystery and things to look at. And it does help, of course, that you can run up the side of buildings. Now, I got a new ability. So, there was a recent patch, and I think what actually happened was, let me see if I can show you this, is that they might have given us an extra skill point at level 9 to compensate for the fact that you are invariably going to spend a skill point in your super speed movement thing. However, I decided, because I like going against the grain and I'm a rebel, then I'm going to put another point into movement. And I take something called Inertial Flywheel. And I get, this is a hold jump ability. If you might remember, Sergeant Queensbury was able to glide when he held jump. Well, apparently this will convert energy to forward speed. So, we're going to give this a try. Ooh, there we go. Give me some more forward speed. You know you want to. And run for my life, indeed. Meow. Uh, what? Whoa. Okay. Wow. Still not, not as easy as you might think to do that. But this is great. I love it. It's tricky to control as hell. But oh yeah. Ah, the cameras. They do nothing. Oh yes. For all of the issues that this game has, it's still freaking hilarious. Stop right now. God damn you, Dark Halibut. You've got, you to, got stop to stop me. Nobody can. Oh, God. <laughs> Where is the toggle? Oh, God. Thank God. Right. Okay. I've stopped moving. Oh, but I found a thing. So it's all good. I'm happy now. Uh, always nice to find a collectible. What have we got? Show me. Harry, I have told you. Do not touch my equipment. I can't tell if this is set to send, receive, or electrocute. Well, I could be broadcasting a signal to Morrow Rig and liquefying every brain cell at Gotham at this very moment. Daddy has a gang war to plan. I've got Bane and the Falcones at each other's throats. Now all I need is... Harley? You what? Don't, Tiny, don't! Don't touch anything! <laughs> Well, that might very well be the best thing I've ever heard. Now, I'm fairly sure I was supposed to be doing something important. I can never quite remember because all this nonsense keeps happening. That's the problem with this game. There's too many cool things to find. Indulge my comic sensibilities. The thing is, I was never really into comics. I'm sort of getting into them now. Probably the whole point of this. I'm sure DC is thrilled by it. <laughs> right, anyway. We beat Bane. There's, there's only one true Bane. So... Get it. There we go. <laughs> so much for Bane's entry in my gang war. I'll have to think of who to put in harm's way next. Uh, Two-Face? Hush? Perhaps even the Penguin? So many possibilities. Now run along and speak with Catwoman at the safe house, and we'll talk again soon. Ta-ta! Yes. Yes, we will. Right, that was a ton of experience up. I'm going to be getting them to level 10 in this particular video, which means I get to choose an iconic power, and you know exactly which one I'm going for. Shoot patience out of my eyes! No, not lasers, patience, common courtesy, something! Hmm, false modesty. Okay. Ooh, and a new staff is what I'm going to be getting once I get that. That's fantastic. What the hell's this? Oh, yeah, this has been done, so... And the lighthouse cleanup has as well, actually, so... Onward! For great manners. Oh, yeah, I assume this this does give you a little bit of forward momentum, which is nice because it's something you didn't otherwise get. 
I'm not 100% convinced by the extra super speed thing because it's so hard to control. I mean, if you were flying, no problem, but there's so many buildings here that you end up just getting stuck. You showed those rat cops a thing or two, eh? Here's a little respect courtesy of the family. Indeed. It's unfortunate that I have to go into the quest log to claim my bloody cola. Why? Why would you do this? I do not know. I just do not know. No, no. Oh, God. Activate super speed. Help. Oh, God. Stop me. Stop. Where's the button? Ugh. Being a super villain is not an easy job. Especially when you can't control your powers. Now, the shepherd. Oh, nice. Very nice. <laughs> that is not bad at all, is it? Right. Okay, lighthouse keeper. Th th thanks. I, I think. If I give this to you, will yes. you go away? Yes, I will. It will be wonderful. Why the hell did you have that? I don't know, but I'll take it anyway. Delicious. Upgrades is always good. Sad thing is, I ended up getting blue shoulders that were worse than my other blue shoulders. Good. Alright. Nanite reinforced cloak. I lose a little bit of health, but I gain all sorts of great stuff. So let's do that, I guess. I think that's broken. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Oh, this is an upgrade as well. Get so much gear, I keep forgetting. Oh, it's because I'm not actually wearing any legs. And he's not wearing any trousers, damn it! Yes, there we go. Okay. Are we in a better state? Do we know what we're doing? Kinda. Oh, hello, dearie. Stop that, Dark Halibut. Okay. Is there anything else I've forgotten to do? All of this is just... The problem with the quest log is now filling up with stuff that I don't actually need. That notification quest, like, go to the Hall of Doom, do this, do that, bloody bloody blah, blah, blah. Like, yeah, I am well aware. Are, are they actually giving me something useful here? Maybe. Tend to sell. What's this? Oh, yeah, I didn't finish that, and I'll be damned if I can be asked to either. This. Nah. <laughs> okay, whatever. And I'm not going to the waterfront either. Can't be bothered with that right now, so. Ah! This is Calculator. Ready for the big leagues, kid? You are invited to the Hall of Doom to hang out with the secret society of supervillains. And you thought your villainy went unnoticed. Use the nearest teleporter. And I'll show you the ropes. Love to. Damn if I can remember where the bloody thing is. Oh, yeah. There's an easy way to do that, isn't there? Go to the map and press Warp HQ. There we go. Oh, hello. Stop it. Okay. We are in business. Right. Burnley Nightclub. Is that the right one? I can't. Not for the life of me, remember. Because I need to go get that staff before we do anything else. Uh, actually, no, we'll be all right. Never mind. So many things to do. It's triggering my attention deficit disorder. I don't really have that, but if I did, it would explain a lot of my nonsense. Here it is. The Hall of oh. Doom. I get a chill, don't you? Or maybe it's the air conditioning. They keep it low for Mr. Freeze. Ready to start your tour? Just follow your mini-map and activate the consoles to hear my dulcet tones. How could I refuse? If your mentor is the Joker and you're somehow Wait a minute, we did still that alive, already. you'll get a bang out of this tech wing. This is where you can spot badasses like Catwoman, Metallo, and the Flash's rogues gallery. Not to mention get the nastiest weapons and gear from the factional vendors. If it fires, explodes, or has pointy edges, they sell it. Why did they send me here at level 10 when you can get access to it at level freaking 1? I just don't understand. Maybe Joker's playing tricks. As you've probably figured out, the Hall of Doom is like an enormous smorgasbord of deadly stuff to buy, sell, and trade. But if you haven't earned enough renown with the factions, forget it. They ain't selling. Am I going to find out anything remotely useful here? No oh, greetings. How are you doing today? Hmm. He didn't respond. The bank. My favorite of the Hall of Doom. Where the gear lives. Keep your honor among thieves. Show me the weaponry. Indeed. Do I really need to use the bank? Access console and sabotage chamber. Which one? Right. Well, I don't need to put anything in the bank because I can vendor all this crap. Oh, there's another one. Okay. 
This could take some time. I must entertain you. This is the main hall. You'll find entrances for each of the three wings. The east and west banks, the brokers, and the command and control center here. You will also find the mailboxes in the main hall as well. Well, don't blame me. You're the ones who asked for live. Otherwise, I'd happily edit this stuff. But no, can't do anything of the sort, can we? No, we're going to have the live experience. Yes, it'll be so fantastic. Oh, you must do the live experience. No, the live experience is bad. Because you end up having things like this. Because you can't necessarily trust the content to always be great. Therein lies the problem with live. Uh, if I'm wandering across the plains of someone that's in somewhere that's incredibly boring, then I'd you'd have to worry about that if I'm doing it post, but no. Also, super speed is really inconvenient sometimes. You know, I would like to have flight, but as I demonstrated previously, my abilities to fly are not exactly amazing. Also, it's down there, isn't it? God damn it. Where, is it a, some really precise area that I'm missing here? Da, 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 aha! Have I finally explored it all? That would be great. Wonderful. Fantastic. Thank you very much. This room is the brains of the Hall of Doom. Not counting me. First, Command and Control. Featuring the kick-ass hottie Talia Al Ghul Don't Tell Her I Said That, <laughs> who assigns our global alerts. You can also see, but not touch, the Inner Sanctum. Only for the big league. Lex, the Joker, Cersei. Be really bad. And maybe someday you'll get inside. Hmm. Always like a little bit of spectating. That is going on in there anyway. I'm fairly sure it's nothing remotely useful. He's just poncing around. Lex is ogling Cersei, and that really is about it, isn't it? Right. Okay, I think we... No, we... there was an armory. Now, as I recall, actually, there's supposed to be a place in here that allows you to respec, and as you might have noticed, I've got two powers that are really, really similar, and I dislike that. It's boring. I wanted to replace one of them. So if I can find the sodding thing, then we'll be all right. Armory! All the way down here. Why the hell are we in the magic wing now? Ooh, uh, let's speak to the Riddler. Yes, we'll deal with him in a moment. This is the Hall of Doom Armory. Nice, eh? Just smell that bracing, weapons-filled air. The Riddler is usually skulking around here with investigations to assign. So he tells riddles. His check's clear. I should definitely speak to him. Might be something entertaining going on. Also, oh, well, it's a sparring target, and it's level 30, right. It's probably not a good thing. Oh, it's okay, you can just beat the snot out of it. I'm happy about that. Makes me feel much better about myself. Also, you can get mad combo. Now, I was told that the best way to actually charge up your... You see that thing down there, number four, sort of my volcano power? It's to get mad, ridiculous combo. I wonder just how far you can take that. Oh, God damn it! I reset it. Well, whatever. <laughs> okay, Mr. Riddler, what you got for me? Riddle me this. What unlocks meaning but isn't a key? A clue. And our world is full of clues, briefings, and collectibles. Calculators even rigged your interface to show color-coded markers when one's nearby. There's a quick investigation right here in the hall. Find it, and come back to me. I'm fairly sure I've done most of this, actually. I think I did. It could be elsewhere. Oh, well, never mind. I don't really care all that much. We still need to be locating the power core. I want to get through this and find out what the hell's going on. Knowing my luck, it is not remotely important, and I'm just completely wasting my time. But we shall find out nonetheless. Don't want to miss out on something cool. Where is the power core? Why is it even taking me to the magic wing anyway? Why, why am I supposed to care about the sodding magic wing? Do I look magical to you? No. Also, this is... No, just don't use that ability ever again. It is a disaster every single time it happens. 
barely have the ability to control this to begin with. Oh, it's a purple thing. Fantastic. Continue on to power core. Okay, I am inside the power core. Can't be that powerful because it's not melting me or anything. Downwards for great manners, I suppose. God, I'm never going to find my way out of here, am I? It'll be an absolute disaster. It just lo looks like exactly the same area. What? You are now in the Hall of Doom's power core. It's where the society throws people who piss us off. No, really. Also down here, you'll find Captain Cold and Black Adam. In the mood to just go and trash some heroes, they have the hookup. The PvP, in other words. You see, this is the problem. I need, I really do need to actually finish this now, because if I don't, then I'm going to feel bad. Fool! I'm only a hologram. Go bother one of my other selves. Oh, congratulations. Must be a riot at parties. Okay, up we go. Which is the most convenient way? Oh, yes, that would be using flight, which I do not have. Oh, like, hey, I've got this amazing ability to... Oh, no, I don't. I just get stuck on walls. Metallo. You know, I'm not familiar with this guy, honestly. Really not. This ain't for any two-bit hack job. It's one classy chassis. You have to earn it. And when you... Da -da -da -de -blah. I don't even know where I am now. Oh, it's Ambush Bug. Uh, and there's Catwoman. Can I hand... I probably can't even hand it in here, can I? You no. look like someone out for a thrill while gaining some skill. I'm no. So, one of the five different Catwomans, or Catwomen, I suppose, all over the place is one I need to talk to, but not that one specifically. How does that make any bloody sense? Speaking of not making any sense, yes, quite. I shall leave this place. I'm sorry I've overstayed my welcome, and that's not remotely polite. Please, let's just get this over with. Want to go beat some fools up? What else am I supposed to say? Other than the fact that this game throws you all over the place and gives you information you really don't need. I mean, <laughs> if you wanted some tutorial stuff, surely this would be good to put it at the start of the game and not at level 9 or 10. Evidently not. <laughs> Uh, do I sound annoyed? I am mildly irritated, I must say. Please, this, there can't be any more of this. The Hall of Doom hangar is where the Society keeps our aircraft. And Professor Zoom. He likes to hang out in here. He set up races all over the dang world, so if that's your thing, he's your psychopath. The pit? Oh my... Uh, most of this stuff is useless. I mean, why did they build all this? I don't suppose villains are all that practical, really, especially not the super kind. Evidently not. Oh no, it's bald man! Truly astonishing and terrifying! You know, you get one of those redemption stories. A lot of villains seem to have that in comics and things like that. And Bald Man's redemption story simply involves him fighting just for men, hair follicle restorer. It's not as exciting as the others. God. Let me guess, the pit's all the way down there. Unsurprisingly, the pit is downwards. This nugget of wisdom brought to you by Dark Halibut. You know, I am a supervillain, so I am deliberately wasting your time. As eventually, I'll waste enough of your time that you will die. In fact, everyone will, and I will be the most superest of supervillains ever. Nah! <laughs> oh, God. Welcome to the very bowels of the Hall of Doom. <laughs> Sorry. Down here is where we keep the society simulator so you can beat up folks while wearing someone else's costume. Sounds fun? Just check in with Catwoman. And ambush bugs should be around somewhere if you're looking for the vault drops. 
Not that you need to do any of this. That's the point, because it's all accessible via the alert menu. More to the point, actually, I think we're finally finding the thing that I actually need. The bad. Oh my good, please. Does this let me respec? Hate the powers you chose? We rigged them here for the right price. With our brand new biological adjustment devices, or bad, courtesy of Lexcore. Bad. Get it? B A. Thank you, Calculator. You truly are a superior intelligence. Finally! And it actually got us level 10 as well. That's absolutely sodding wonderful. Well, oh, we don't have to do anything just yet. So, can we respect? Yes. Yeah. Whatever. Okay. No, I'm going to spend the money on anything anyway. Now, I've heard of a power that's much, much better than the engulf flamey one, so let's find it. Now, firstly, take that one, definitely, absolutely, we want emulation. But what we don't want is in flame, because in flame's boring. What we do want is Meteor Strike. And I grab that one instead. Yes, isn't it delicious? Right, Flashpoint. Reignition. You know, this one is really, really cool, but I... This is more useful, honestly, so I might grab that. Go, grab one of those. And I've got one point left. Which means, iconic power. Heat vision, of course. What else was I going to get? I'll show you what there is anyway. Amazonian deflection. Nah. Boring. Batarang triple shot. Mm, not so super. Robot sidekick. That's kind of cool. Well, you know, a little mini robot would be kind of nice, but I don't think I could trust it to behave. Hard light shield. Yeah, we know what that is. That's Green Lantern. What is this? Mesmerizing las las lasso. Lasso. God knows. Yes. Sonic Cry, Heat Vision, Freezing Breath, that's alright, Neo Venom Boost, Word of Power, that's Black Adam, I assume, Pheromone Bloom, looks like a little Cthulhu, and Sonic Shout, Heat Vision, obviously, who would not want to fire lasers from their eyes? Now, back to loadouts and movements, etc. No. We have unlocked our tanking role, by the way, so we will look into that momentarily. However, movement. Speed force. Do I need inertial flywheel? Yeah, inertial flywheel is actually handy, so we'll grab that. And respec ourselves all the way around. Grab ourselves. Oh, you can actually... I think I can actually put particles into a second weapon now. If I wanted, but I'll stick with the staff for the time being. We'll look into something like a ranged weapon later. So what did we have? Focused spin, which actually is not exactly amazing. So I might go sweeping slice instead. Grab that one. Roundhouse combo. Oh, and I can actually go all the way down there. I have an additional skill point to spend. Wonderful. We might do that. So you got these stats upgrades, which... Well, they're boring, aren't they? So, you want something that allows you to kick somebody in the face, which would be this one, the downward smash combo. Tap, 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 hold and tap. Yes. Oh, that's a quite a long combo, isn't it? Okay. So, may maybe there are two forms of that combo. And uh, different versions of it. Hmm, neat. And we can grab a point once we actually get it into a second weapon now that we're at level 10. Sorted. Heat vision. Yes. Fire lasers. Yeah. You know, the only disappointing thing about that is that I can't actually customize the color of it because that's amazing. Totally awesome. Right. Return to the Techman Teleport. I'd love to. No idea how. Can I use the rally point? Please tell me I can. Sodding hell. Evidently not. Okay. On we go. We'd actually like to kind of get some questing done as opposed to just making this video. Total Biscuit wanders around the freaking Hall of Doom doing absolutely nothing of any note. Although that's most likely what it's going to end up being, let's be honest. Not every video will be gold. That's the excuse that I keep making to myself. Helps me get through the day. Although most videos will involve Total Biscuit getting stuck on something. Right, here's a teleport. Let's use that one. That concludes. Oh.
I lost the voice acting, damn it! Oh, that concludes our tour. That was an entire waste of time, yes. And I have no intention of ever going back there again. Damn villains and the trickery. Okay. I want to test out some new powers. I really don't care about the rest of the stuff. What I do need to do is speak to Catwoman so we can get the next set of quests. Give me my staff, woman. All that, and you're not even on Venom. I'll remember to keep you on my short list. What the hell is with the floating stuff? Where's the gut? Catwoman apparently is suddenly some kind of crazy ass psychic that can float furniture. Combat energy staff. Fantastic. Let's get this equipped, and I have to wonder whether or not it looks awesome. He is hoping it does. I'd like to upgrade my looks just a little bit. Primary weapon. Hulk headed staff. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that. That's neat. That's very neat. It's even got spikes on it and everything. Yeah, we'll stick with that. I'm happy about that. Yeah. Feeling a bit more villainous now. Always a good thing. These damn dancers. I'll teach them some manners. Yeah. Hmm. They don't care, do they? They just think it's some kind of pretty laser light show that DJ put on. <sighs> My villainy always goes so unappreciated by the mewling masses. Questing time. Earning respect. Tomorrow will be gigantic. That sounds fun. Meet Mother Blood in the Chinatown safe house. And in respect, little Bohemia. A agent respect. There's an agent called respect? Seriously? Okay, then. I guess we're talking to that person. LexCore's agent respect has an urgent job for you at the little Bohemian nightclub. Do you think they choose their code names or pull them out of a hat? If you find out, let me know. See, even he believes me. Right, we're going to just go run across the city for this because I'll be damned if I can find the teleport inside a bloody hall of doom. There's also a race, but we're not going to bother with that for the time being. Go to Metropolis to continue your mission. All right, okay. We're out of Gotham? That's kind of disappointing, isn't it? So I can either go there or I can go to Chinatown. Right. Hmm. I don't know which one I actually want to do. As far as I'm aware, there's no easy access per se. But I could be wrong. I don't think I can warp to that. Nope. No, I cannot. So, it looks like we're using the Hall of Doom teleporter. I just got out of that sodding place. Why would they do that? It would be wonderful if I didn't have to do that, but hey. It's like we're dealing with it. So, there's some awesome blatant design flaws in this game. As much as I find it amusing and fun and fantastic in a lot of different ways... There are some things that just make you want to scream! Or indeed blow something up, but screaming would be impolite, so we're not going to be doing anything like that. So, what Dark Halibut would do is, of course, write a strongly worded letter. Hmm, yeah, strongly worded letter. Trust me, it's more effective than you might think. Please let me get up there. I only want to use the teleporter. I can't see anything because of the sodding camera angles. Okay, am I... Right, it's down here. It's not even... Oh, why would it do this to me? I don't even know which is the right teleporter. It, you know, it would have been handy. To, why is it doing this? Just let me up there. Oh, it's changing direction for no reason. Oh, this is the rudest wall I've ever seen. Please cooperate. Thank you. Right, that is the Burnley nightclub. That is useless. We need to go to the other ones. And I'm not going super speed as much as I want to. I'm not doing it. Metropolis Midtown. Uh, that'll do. I'll just run across the rest of it. Whatever. <laughs> now, we will be doing an alert at, someone at, at some point anyway. Oh, hand-ins. Fantastic. Let's do that while we're here. I am Talia Al Ghul. You'll find my hologram in all of the society clubs. I assign global alerts. Crises all over the world ripe for our exploitation. Excellent. Calculator has added the Australian right, arena to your list of scenarios. You are in Once area an 51. arena is in your list... Blah, 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 blah. blah. <laughs> boring, boring people. 
So, let's find our way out of there, and then we can run across Metropolis and cause a little bit of mayhem in the process. I certainly hope so. Now, I did show you a bit of Metropolis in our collab crossover video, but maybe some of you didn't watch that. So, you'll get to see a little bit of it. Ah, it's so damn clean. Look at that. Oh, Superman statue. We can get achievement points if we go to the top of it. Quickly, onward to Superman's crotch. There you go. Fantastic. Right. Go to Club Lex Salons. Lex, oh, I, I, oh. When exactly did Lex come up with all these awful bloody puns? I couldn't tell you, but it is horrific. It would be nice if there was an ability to lock your camera angle, but whoa, you can do some fun stuff with that power. That's the best thing about it, really. The sense of momentum and the way that you actually travel in this game is second to none. You know, flying in WoW, not even close. Any other MMO I've played with their travel? Pfft. Can you do this in WoW? No. Can you do this in any other MMO? Well, you can sort of do it in Champions and stuff like that, but... When I played Champions with the movement in that, it just, it did, you just couldn't get up this kind of momentum. And I think that's really what gives it the edge because it feels like something like Infamous or Prototype. And as a direct result of that, it just is fun. You know, it gives a great bit of immersion. Across the entire city at hyper speed. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's a reminder to mind your manners. Flying through the air with deadly laser powers. You know, that was unnecessary. I apologize for that. Collectibles. Secrets. Chief Researcher's Journal. This heart is a telltale example of our profound work. A telltale heart, eh? Sure is veiled references up in here. Oh, we're almost there. It's good. A thing. Do I care about it? No. It's probably really low level anyway. You know, I would have liked to stay in Gotham for a bit longer, but I, know, I think there are a few things I could do, but we'll go with this for the time being. Would be nice to find out what's going on over the other side of town. Lexalot. There is, you know, there's a reason. I knew there was a reason why I didn't want to have Lex as my mentor. Evidently, this is it. He's got a terrible sense of humor. Okay, where's the dude? Here we go. Lex Corp funds the meta wing of Metropolis General Hospital as a front for some very illegal experiments. Something went haywire and the patients are rioting. We need those patients back. And the press kept out. I'll give you a special encasement device to use. Sounds like fun. Yes, I will happily go into a hospital and beat people up. Well, I'm a villain. What do you expect? Good. You're on the job. It seems patients at my meta-human wing at Metropolis General Hospital are resisting Dr. Psycho's experimental treatment. But work on the meta-human brain is at a crucial stage. I don't need this interruption or the publicity. Put down the riot and retrieve my test subjects. How dare they? I'll teach them some common courtesy. Lex has a mission for you if you want it. The Hive is taking a bite out of LexCore's transports down by the Metrodome. You are by far the most disgusting wrestler I've ever seen. No, I have no interest in the Hive thing. We're going to go do the hospital thing and then we shall leave because overall this episode has proven to be absolutely pointless. Ugh, it's almost, almost enough to make me want to throw somebody off a bridge. I wonder if there's an opportunity to do that. Don't worry. Please, you've got to help. Mm. I'm thinking, no, lasers! It's so disappointing that you cannot slaughter them. Okay. Hospital Havoc. Let's do it. I assume I'm going in the right direction. One way to find out. Super speed, straight into a lamppost. That's always the way to do it. Yeah. It moves so sodding fast in this game. It is great, even though it's really hard to control. Really? No, we do not care about the hive, whoever the hell they are. More interested in what's going on in the mental hospital. 
I know, I, I am well aware that it's... Oh, I wish I landed on that. I wish I would have felt so baller, but no. You did this, Don't... But... Like, why is Lex not speaking? Oh, hi. Uh, this is unfortunate. Also, these guys kind of hit pretty hard. It's all right, we can subdue them with that. How do you like this? 20 of them. And bring them to the transport. Also known as hit people with them because it's much more fun this way. Please. There you go. Aha! <laughs> die, you fools! Die! Yes. Oh dear, it broke him out. Oh well. Uh, right. You know, I would have an opportunity to actually use this laser thing, aren't it? There you go. Cab it in blazers, yes. Hmm. That's alright. Stop! You're hurting what? me! No shiz I am! If I wasn't, I'd be a little bit concerned that my powers weren't doing their job. Right. Where the hell am I going for this transport? And can I just throw them in there? In one of the previous quests while I was doing this, that was alright. Am I here? Yes. Okay, yeah, that's where it has to go. Fantastic. I really, really, really do not know why they had to make it 20 and 10. I, that is just... That's... That's excessive. Do you, do you know what I reckon it's excessive? I, it, it is a tad excessive. You oh, doctor! It was you who experimented yes, on Yes, of course it was. Couldn't you tell your doctor was a robot with a style and hat? No, of course you couldn't. You should trust your doctor. I like how the game reminds you to loot stuff because I constantly forget. Okay, let's try and throw it. One, two, and up you go. Give me the credit. Yeah. Yeah, see? That is what I'm talking about. I say some of the quests do get a bit generic in this game. It's just unfortunate they sent us here to do basically something we've already done just in oh, a different doctor, area. It was you who experimented on me. I think you've got to find some repetition in MMOs all the time. It's just this dwells quite, quite close in my memory. I mean, think about it. This is basically the same thing that I did when I was holding off Brainiac's forces. So I have, I have issues with that. If you're going to have repetition, at least spread it out to a reasonable degree. Don't make yes players go and do it after a couple of hours of play because let's be honest I mean I've only played this for a few hours everything I've done has been recorded so you know exactly what I'm doing all the time I don't play this game outside of recording although I would kind of like to I might start a new character for that very purpose anyway you what I'd like to show to me. you is Please. Meteor you have to end this experiment. watch this so you can call a Meteor then what you can do is you can pick up the Meteor and you can hit them with it because it's the best Oh, it doesn't matter if this game's competitive. It's got the best combat system of all time. Of all time. Yes. Now, as you might also have noticed there, I did get a combo. It's reignition. Gave me some health back. I say it's nice. It's a damage and a little bit of a heal as well. Taking huge amounts of damage from these guys. I don't know what the hell they're doing. But it hurts. I can guarantee you. Okay, wonderful. I do have to, again, express ahead, my disappointment for the fact that the next set of missions do just take me through here. Because, you know what? I don't care about Lex Luthor. And I certainly don't care about Cersei either. You know, I care about the Joker. The Joker's badass. Maybe just because I skipped a bunch of stuff. I, oh, I missed, didn't I? Uh, get back here. How inconvenient. There we go. Right, I'm going to come back to this later, honestly, because I just do not quite have the patience for it. I think it's probably because I was mucked about for 20 minutes with that damn tour of the place that I'd already been for no apparent reason. And it is it's just infuriating. Why would you do that? I just cannot imagine. My name is Donald Biscuit. And by the looks of it, I'm going to have to teach SOE some manners, perhaps with lasers for my eyes. I'll see you next time.